Today is Saturday, May 28th, 2023, in the year of our Lord. A miraculously blessed May, everyone. Welcome to March On to Victory Prayers with Prophetess Seneth Brown, the founder and host pastor of the New Testament Church of Christ, the Redeemer of Canada, a place where dreams are realized and destinies are fulfilled. If you have not yet subscribed to Redeemer of Canada, please do so now and don't forget to click on the icon for notifications. Thanks very much for doing so. It is highly appreciated. Thank you. Today's prayer topic is, it's time to guard your mind. It's time to guard your mind. Our scripture reading for today is Romans 12 verses 1 and 2 and Colossians 3 verses 1 and 2. Romans 12 verses 1 and 2 declares, I beseech you therefore brethren by the mercies of God that he present your bodies a living sacrifice, holy, acceptable unto God, which is your reasonable service. And be not conformed to this world, but be ye transformed by the renewing of your mind, that he may prove what is that good and acceptable and perfect will of God. Colossians 3 verse 1 to 3 says, if he then be risen with Christ, seek those things which are above, where Christ sitteth on the right hand of God. Set your affection on things above, not on things on the earth, for ye are dead, and your life is hid with Christ in God. And I honor the word of the Lord by saying, Glory be to the Father, to the Son, to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, it is now and ever shall be. It is world without end. Amen, 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 and amen. Bless the name of the Lord. Welcome to March On to Victory Prayers with Prophetess Seneth Brown. Prayer topic for today, it's time to guard your mind. Thank you, Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. I bless the Trinity. I salute the Trinity. God the Father, God the Son, and God the Blessed Holy Ghost. There is none like you. And I come in the only name that I know how to come in and should come in whereby we must be saved. And that name is Jesus Christ of Nazareth. In the name of Jesus Christ, I come honoring, O oh God Almighty, his name. O oh, Abba Father, thank you for your blood-stained banner through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Thank you, O oh God, that you have made Jesus Christ of Nazareth. He who without sin became sin for humanity. Thank you. Ah, the gift, O oh God Almighty, that none can even put into words, O oh God Almighty, cannot even be articulated if we were to begin to describe how powerful God is, how amazing God is, how miraculous, O oh God Almighty, is our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Thank you for sending Jesus Christ into the world. Hallelujah. Glory to God Almighty. Even though many has rejected him, refused him, neglected him. My God, but you have him. You anointed him, appointed him. Oh God Almighty, allowed him to gain stature. Oh God Almighty, and favor with God and man. Hallelujah. You are the God of the book of St. Luke. You are the God our God in the four Gospels, Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John. Hallelujah. Glory to the name of Jesus. Glory, oh God Almighty, to the triune, powerful, oh God, all in all, sufficient God. And there is none like you. 
Ah, Jesus, 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 the way, the truth, and the life. St. John 14, verse 6 declares, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one cometh unto the Father but by me. Hallelujah. Only through Jesus Christ that we can come to the Father of the heavens and the earth. Hallelujah. Thank you that you are our beginning and you are our ending. Oh, thank you that you are the God in the book of Genesis all the way to Revelation. Thank you, oh God Almighty, that you are the God in the middle of the book. You are the God in our lives, beginning, middle, and ending. You are the unchanging God and there is none like you. I call I call you the lily of the valley. I call you, hallelujah, I am that I am. I call you the amazing bread. I call you, oh God, hallelujah, glory to God, the unquenching water of life. Hallelujah, glory to God, glory to God. When we are thirsty, you said, come, oh God, he that is heavy laden and I will give you rest. Oh God Almighty, this is a season of rest for your people. Oh God, this is a season, oh God Almighty, of Matthew. Oh God Almighty, eleven twenty-eight. Oh God, this is a season, oh God, that you, oh God, are calling your people into spiritual rest. Oh God Almighty, this is a season that you're calling your people into perpetual peace. Oh God Almighty, hope above that which is going on in our natural world. Hallelujah. Glory to the name of the Lord our God. Hallelujah to the great King of heaven and the earth. Hallelujah to the Prince of the universe. Oh, glory to God. It's time. Oh, God Almighty, it is time. It's time to guard ah, your mind. It is time to guard your mind because out of, oh, God Almighty, the heart. Guard your heart as well because out of the heart flows the issues of life. Oh God Almighty, thank you. Oh God, that we're going to guard our minds because we know God that the filthiness of this world, oh God, can contaminate our minds as your people. Oh God Almighty, but we will not, oh God, keep our minds, oh God, and the things of this world, but we will keep our minds, oh God, and the things above as the, oh God, Colossians 3, oh God, declares, oh God Almighty, that we will keep our minds and things above and not things on the earth. Oh God, material things will not, oh God, distract our minds from you, but we, oh God, will focus. Lord God, it's time to guard our minds. It's time to guard your mind, people of God. We need to guard our minds. Hallelujah. Glory. Glory to God, because the battlefield or where the enemy fights us most is in the mind. But this mind that God has intricately given unto us, oh God Almighty, supernaturally will supersede the powers of hell, the powers of darkness. Oh God, the world's wickedness will not contaminate our minds. The world's evil will not contaminate our minds, because we are going to guard our minds, Father, with the word of God. Uh, let this mind be in you. Oh, let this mind be within us, uh, that which was in Christ Jesus. Uh, oh, God, so we call forth, uh, oh, God, the mind of Christ right now in our minds. We call forth the power of Christ within our minds. We call forth the restorative, uh, oh, God, a mighty source of the Almighty over our minds. Almighty God, there's power in the mind. Mind. Oh, God Almighty, there's power, there's power, there's power. And so we come to say it's time to guard the mind because the
the mind is powerful. And so we ask of your Father God that you will touch our minds. You will touch the minds of God's people. You will touch the minds of humanity. You will touch the minds in society. Almighty God, many, oh God, has lost their minds. Many, oh God, are insane out of it, God Almighty. Uh, they're not in their right mind today. But I speak, God Almighty, restoration to their uh, sickness, oh God, uh, to the brokenness of their minds. Lord God, I speak healing, oh God, unto the minds that are oh, not whole today. Oh God Almighty, thank you for bringing wholesomeness to broken minds. Oh God Almighty, thank you that this is a season of wellness. This is a season of wellness. So I speak wellness to our minds. I speak, oh God, that will guard our minds with the word of God. Oh, we are going to guard our minds in the word of God. We are going to allow the word of God, hallelujah, to transform our minds. Oh God Almighty, from the things of this world. Oh God Almighty, from the evil within society. Oh God Almighty, from the lawlessness in humanity. Oh God, our minds, oh God. Oh God Almighty, from God, our minds, oh God, from the world's, oh God, profanity. Guard our minds, God, from iniquity workers. Guard our minds, God, from the forces of darknesses and hell. Oh God, our minds, Father. Oh God Almighty, with your power. Oh God Almighty, with your might. Oh God Almighty, guard our minds. Oh God, that it will be steadfast in your word. Oh God Almighty, so that we will, oh God, dwell upon your word. Oh God, our minds, oh God, as we dwell in the secret place of the Most High God. Oh God, Psalm 91, we will continue to dwell in the secret place. We will saturate, we ask that you will saturate our minds, oh God, and keep it dwelling. Oh God, keep our minds dwelling in the secret place of the Most High God. We ask you right now, God, that you will saturate, oh God, with the power of the Holy Ghost, our minds, oh God Almighty, and keep us, oh God Almighty, as the apple of thine eye, oh God Almighty, we will bank, oh God, and we will read and see and meditate upon Psalm 17 and 18 and 19, oh God Almighty, glory to God of Zion, let the word of my mouth and the meditation of my heart be acceptable in thy sight, O Lord. You are my strength and my redeemer. O blessed redeemer. O guard our minds. Guard the minds of your people. O God, in a troubling world, in a troublesome world, in a trying and dying world, guard the minds of your people. O God, from evil plots and plans. O guard, O God, God, the minds of your people, oh God, by inputting, oh God Almighty, oh God, Jeremiah 29, 11, within, oh God Almighty, guard the minds of your people, oh God, by putting, oh God Almighty, Joel 1 and 2, oh God, guard the minds of your people, oh God, by inputting, oh God Almighty, Romans 12, Oh, glory to God. Guard the minds of your people. Oh, glory to God. By depositing, oh God Almighty, Ephesians 6. Oh, God, guard the minds of your people. Oh, glory to God Almighty. Oh, God, by depositing, oh God, within the minds of your people. Ephesians 3. Oh, God, verses 20 and 21. Oh, God, the minds of your people. Oh, make the minds of your people whole again. Oh, glory to God and deposit the book of James. Oh, God Almighty, into the minds of your people worldwide. Oh, God, many are suffering worldwide. Oh, God Almighty, from mental illnesses, many are suffering, God, oh, from the mind. Oh, God Almighty, issues. Oh, God, from the mind. Ah, oh, God Almighty, imbalances from the mind. Lord God, I ask you right now to restore uh, 
oh God, minds that are not sane, oh God Almighty, ah oh God Almighty, that are insane, minds that are insane, oh God Almighty, bring them back to restoration, bring them back to wholesomeness and divine health and healing, Lord God, oh God, our minds, God, oh with your word, oh God, Psalms 119, verse 105, oh God Almighty, thy word is a lamp unto my feet and a light unto my path, oh yes God, the guiding hand of God, oh God Almighty, put your guiding hand, oh God, upon the minds of your people, oh God, keeping us steadfast and movable, always abound in the things of the Lord, for as much as we know our labor in you is not in vain, oh God, we hold on, oh God, steadfastly, oh God, to 1 Corinthians 15, oh God, we hold on, oh God, to 1 Corinthians 13, oh God, bring about love, oh God, your agape love, oh God, your unconditional love, oh God, God, flood our minds with your love. Oh, flood our minds with your peace. Oh, flood our minds, God Almighty. Oh, God, uh, with your divine words. Oh, God Almighty, because your word is powerful. Your word is sharp. Your word is quick. Oh, God, is sharper than any two-edged swords. My God, so guide our minds in your word. Oh, God, our minds, God Almighty, in the book of Hebrews. Oh, God Almighty, God, our minds, God, uh, hallelujah, that we will worship you in spirit and in truth. Oh, glory to God Almighty. God, our minds, God, uh, and let us dive into St. John 4. Oh, God Almighty, glory, glory, glory. Oh, God, our minds, God, uh, that we will look on to St. John 14, 1 to 3. Oh, God Almighty, and verse 27, uh, for the peace in which you give unto us, uh, the peace indeed uh, that you left for us, uh, not as the world give it, uh, oh God Almighty, you give it, uh, oh God Almighty, let not uh, our hearts be troubled uh, in a troublesome world, uh, because you will guard us, God Almighty, you will guard us safely uh, to our eternal destiny, my God, uh, hallelujah, protect our minds, oh God, uh, our God, against the forces of darknesses, Oh, protect uh, our minds, oh God, uh, from the workers, uh, oh God, the spiritual and uh, God Almighty wickedness in high places. Uh, oh God Almighty, guard our minds, uh, oh from oppositions, uh, guard our minds, God Almighty, oh from secret devices, uh, oh God of Lucifer, oh secret devices, uh, oh God of Satan, secret devices uh, of our enemies, secret devices, uh, oh God. God Almighty, guard our minds, God. Let the things that are good, that which is a virtue, that which holds truth, that which holds a purity, that which holds justice, that which holds righteousness. Oh God Almighty, guard our minds. Oh God, and wrap up our minds in Philippians 4. Oh God Almighty, 1 through 7. Oh God Almighty, guard our minds. So we will understand that we don't have to go out of the way for providence because our God Almighty, Philippians 4, our God Almighty, verse 19 declares, oh, but my God oh, shall supply all my needs according to his riches in glory. Oh, according to Christ Jesus. Oh, God Almighty, St. John, hallelujah. Oh, 14 reassures us, oh God. Hallelujah, St. John. 11. Oh God reassures us. Oh glory to God Almighty that we have hope. We have hope. We have oh God surpassing hope. Our minds God Almighty has hope because of Jesus Christ's resurrection. Oh God you are. Oh God the resurrection and the life. Oh God Almighty. Oh God Almighty we shall live and live again. Oh glory to God. God our minds. 
oh God Almighty, against worldly lust. Oh God, guard our minds. Oh God, against material lust. Oh God, guard our minds against spiritual lust and jealousies. God Almighty, from powers, principalities, diabolical wickedness. Oh God Almighty, and assignments that are not from you. Oh God, our minds that we will think purely. Oh God Almighty, oh God, purify our minds. Oh God Almighty, take away carnality from the minds of humanity. Oh, take away carnality from the minds of humanity because the minds, oh God, is powerful. Oh God Almighty, and the carnal man, oh, fight always against a spiritual man. Oh, glory to God Almighty. Oh, the carnal man cannot understand the things of the spirit because to him, oh God, all things are carnal. To the carnal, all things are carnal. To the spiritual, all things are spiritual. And so God Almighty, oh, give us a dose, oh God, of your spiritual anointing. Oh, give us supernatural Holy Ghost filled, oh God, power, oh God, that will help us, that will empower us, that will help us to overcome, oh God Almighty, the spirit, oh God of divisions, the spirit of envy, the spirit of evil, the spirit of false accusations, oh God Almighty, the enemy comes, oh yes, to steal, kill, and destroy, oh God Almighty, but it did not stop there but Jesus came oh God that we may have life and have life more abundantly oh God Almighty pour out your abundantly bless oh God Almighty life upon the mind of your people upon the minds of society oh glory to God upon the minds oh God within your kingdom oh glory to God transform our minds oh God Almighty that we will think upon the things that are above and not the things on earth. Oh yes, God, transform our minds. Oh God Almighty, that we will receive oh, the Holy Ghost assignments, the Holy Ghost mandates, the Holy Ghost, oh God, scripts, our glory to God Almighty, oh, that we ought to fulfill on the earth. Almighty God, oh, it's time to guard your mind. It's time to guard our minds minds people of God it's time to guard our minds oh God from the dogs that go it to and fro barking to and fro oh the enemies that is glory to God Almighty they walk it oh God on every side oh trying oh God Almighty to take down God's people oh glory to God but I speak steadfastness upon the minds of God's people I speak Oh, courage upon the minds of God's people. Oh, God Almighty, the spirit of courage has heightened upon the minds of God's people times five. Oh, glory to God Almighty, the overcoming power of the Almighty rest upon our minds. Oh, glory to God, oh, the pure, oh, God's sincere word of God rest upon the minds, oh, God of his people within his kingdom. Oh, glory to God Almighty. Oh, yes, renewed minds are in my kingdom, says the Lord. Oh, this is the season oh, of renewed minds because a renewed minds will receive, oh, God Almighty, the mandates of heaven. Oh, glory to God Almighty, because the time cometh, oh, the hour cometh, and now is when God is seeking Oh, God Almighty worshipers, those that will worship him in spirit and in truth. Oh, God, our minds in spirit and in truth and with spirit and truth. Oh, God, our minds with justice and fairness. Oh, God Almighty in a world of injustice and bias and prejudices. Oh, God Almighty, guard our minds. Oh, God Almighty, by upholding, oh God, this time 
standards of righteousness, holiness, oh God Almighty, because you said your word declares, God, that without holiness, no one shall see God. Hallelujah, coming back for a church, oh God Almighty, without spot or wrinkles, my God, without spots and wrinkles, my God, no wrinkles, no spots, Lord God, guard our minds, oh God, with the purity, oh God of heaven, oh God, our minds with the love, oh God of the Almighty, oh God, our minds with the peace that transcend all understanding, oh glory to God Almighty, oh God, our minds, oh God Almighty, that that which, oh God, is pure, that which cometh from you, oh God Almighty, it will edify, oh God, and not destroy, oh God, our minds, God, hallelujah, the guarding power of the Holy Ghost upon the minds of humanity, upon the minds of the church, oh God Almighty, has heightened, oh God, the renewing of the minds, oh God, within my kingdom, oh God, has elevated, oh glory to God, I will take the minds of my people and not only transform them, not only renew them, oh God Almighty, not only transform it, oh glory to God Almighty, but allow all that which it has been designed to do before the creation of the world, before the foundations of the earth, oh God Almighty, to come to, oh God, its highest potential, oh God Almighty, established, oh the work of your hands upon us, oh God, your people, oh God, establish, oh God, ah, the highest potential that we have in you, oh God Almighty, the mind, the mind, oh cover our minds, oh God, our minds, oh God Almighty, because ah, there is power in the mind, oh God of humanity, oh there is divine, oh God anointing, oh God in the minds of humanity, oh God pour out, oh God a fresh touch, oh God almighty a refreshing, a refreshing, oh God a refreshing, oh God has come down to the minds of humanity, the minds of the Christ, oh God the body of Christ, the minds upon the body of Christ, our transforming minds are now upon the bride of Christ, upon the chaste bride of Christ, oh the mind of Christ, oh is within his people, oh God Almighty and within his kingdom, Almighty God thank you, oh God Almighty, that we will guard our minds by the word of God in St. John 15, oh God Almighty, you are the vine and we are the branches, oh God Almighty, we will continue as a branches, oh God, clinging unto the vine so that we will, oh God, bear much fruit and that, oh God Almighty, our fruit will remain, our fruit will have substance, our fruit will be edifying unto the kingdom of God and throughout the world, oh God Almighty, the mind, the mind, the mind, oh God, touch our minds, oh God Almighty, oh God, so that the assignments of heaven will be accomplished, oh God, through your people on earth, oh glory to God Almighty, the mind, the mekunda baba suturieke rea sotora basa nende de bosi lando koshotora basa the mind the mind there's power there's power in the mind ah the mind the mind oh god almighty let your power suffice the mind let your grace suffice the mind let your anointing supersede our minds oh glory to god almighty oh let the excellency of god overpower our minds let 
let the grace of the Almighty God, our God, overshadow our minds. Overshadow our minds, God, with your boundless love, with your boundless mercies, with your boundless goodness, oh God, with your boundless grace, forgiveness, and peace. Oh God, bring unity to the mind. Oh God, unity, spiritual unity, physical unity. Oh God Almighty, psychological unity, mental unity. Oh God Almighty, economical unity. Bring unity, oh God, to the minds of humanity. Oh, unity upon the universal church, the church of the living God, the church of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Glory to God Almighty. Glory to Jesus Christ. Oh, glory to the Son and the Holy Ghost. Glory to the Father, oh God of our fathers. Glory to the King of all kings. Oh, glory to the Prince, oh God above all princes. Oh, glory to the matchless Lamb of God who taketh away the sins of the world. Oh, glory to your name. Oh, transform our minds so that greater glory will be granted unto you. Oh, transform our minds so that God, a greater worship will be given unto you. Oh, transform the minds of our neighbors, God. Oh, that which, so that evil will not penetrate them. Oh, God Almighty, evil will not contaminate them. Oh, God, and the evil of the adversaries will not affect us, oh God, as your people, oh, cover your mind, cover humanity's minds, cover, oh God, the minds within, oh God, your kingdom, oh God Almighty, reestablish your plans over the minds of your people, oh God Almighty, bring about a joy, oh God, new joy to the minds of your people, oh God, joy unspeakable, a joy boundless, oh joy rejoicing, oh a joy, a God. God, that we cannot describe. Oh, good joy within the mind of Christ. Sweep over the mind. Oh, God, with the power of the Holy Ghost. Oh, sweep over our minds, God. Hallelujah. Glory with your divine anointing. Oh, God, with the oil of refreshing. Oh, sweep over our minds. Oh, God, and anoint our heads with oil and our cup overflow. Oh, surely goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives and we shall dwell in the house of the Lord oh forever oh God Almighty we shall dwell oh God Almighty give us minds oh God Almighty that will dwell in the house of the Lord forever oh God give us minds of determination oh God Almighty that we will be determined that as for me and my house we will serve the Lord oh God Almighty give us minds Oh, God Almighty, as Joshua. Oh, God Almighty, that Joshua. Oh, God, oh, Joshua declares, as for me and my house, we will serve the Lord. Oh, God, give us a made-up mind, a determined mind, a mind like Christ. Oh, God Almighty, that we will not look back. We will not look to the right or the left, but we will look. To, oh, God Almighty, we will look unto the hills from whence come it all, our health because all our help cometh from God Almighty that made the heaven and the earth. Almighty God, we will look, oh God Almighty, for Psalms 24 is our hope. We will look, oh God Almighty, to Psalms 46 verse 10. We will be still and know that you are God because indeed you will be exalted over the Edens. You will be exalted over the earth. You will be exalted over the earth. You will be exalted over the floods within the minds of humanity. You will be exalted over the rains within humanity. You will be exalted over the tsunamis. Oh God Almighty within the minds of society. You will be exalted highly above the heathens. You will be exalted. Hallelujah. 
divinely, oh God, supernaturally, because the name of Jesus Christ is indeed an exalted name above all names on this earth, because at the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, oh God, every knee shall bow, and every tongue confess that Jesus Christ is Lord. He's Lord in the heavens. He's Lord on the earth. He's Lord over the waters. He's Lord over the seas and the lands. He's Lord over the creeping things upon our God, the face of the earth and under the, the earth. Oh God Almighty, you are Lord. Hallelujah. In the lives of our children, you are Lord. Oh God, in your tabernacle, you are Lord. In the midst of our congregation, you are Lord. Hallelujah. Moving or oh, delivering, restoring or oh, saving, redeeming mankind's lives. Lord God Almighty, remarrying, oh God, to the backsliders, restoring broken lives. God Almighty, battered and bruised hearts. You are God Almighty, and there is none like you. Oh, ride on, oh God, balm of Gilead, oh God, and heal our minds afresh. Oh God Almighty, balm of Gilead, oh God Almighty, sympathizer, there is no God like you, oh physician above all physicians, oh God Almighty, you are able, oh, to heal the minds that are bruised, oh God, that are not well, oh God Almighty, that are going through, oh problems, oh God, situations that break them, oh God Almighty, I speak restoration, oh God, to broken minds, I speak divine interventions, oh God Almighty, to wounded minds, I speak authority, oh God Almighty, to the defeated minds, I speak, oh God Almighty, that you will come away out of despair, oh God Almighty, to the spirit minds, I speak now, oh God, that your people will walk in freedom of the mind, oh God, they will walk in total authority within the mind, a sound mind that we will have, all oh, because of the power of Jesus Christ, we will walk, oh God, in this world with a sound mind, we will walk, oh God, with sound minds, we will walk, hallelujah, with intact spirits, we will walk, hallelujah, with healed bodies, we will walk, hallelujah, not with carnalities, but oh God Almighty, spirituality, oh God, we will walk, hallelujah, because the God of all impossibilities are with us, the God oh, that declare in his word, oh God, with man, oh God, it is impossible, oh God, but God, with God, all things are possible, oh glory to God Almighty, glory to the God, hallelujah, that pour out upon our minds, the spirit of forgiveness, the spirit of forgiveness, our God has heightened, oh God Almighty, to higher dimensions, oh God, times five, upon the body of Christ, oh God Almighty, you are going to use, oh God, the spirit of forgiveness, oh glory to God through your people, and upon your people, oh glory, 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 oh God, forgiveness will be seen in the churches, my God, our local churches, local ministries, oh God Almighty, but the one universal church, the church of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, oh yes, I heard the spirit of forgiveness, the spirit of forgiveness, hallelujah, will be dosed in the church, hallelujah, 
love the church of Jesus Christ, the church of Jesus Christ with the firm foundation. Oh God, the pillar and ground of truth. Oh God Almighty. Oh, let the forgiving spirit reign. Oh God, times five. Oh God, upon your chaste bride. Oh God, because you're coming back for a church. Oh, glory to God without spots and without wrinkles. There will be no wrinkles. There will be no spots. Almighty God, bring us. Oh God, redeem our minds. Oh God Almighty, transform our minds. Oh God, so that we, oh God, will claim and have and receive the mind of Christ. Oh God, to accomplish. Oh God, that which we were created to accomplish. That which you have birthed us to do. That which you have mantled us to accomplish. That which you have allotted us, oh God. Oh God, to manifest. Oh glory to God. We shall live out all our days on planet earth. We shall live and not die to declare the works of the Lord. And so we gird our minds right now. Oh God, in Psalms 118 verse 17. I shall not die, but live and declare the works of the Lord. I shall not die, but live and declare the works of the Lord. Oh glory to God Almighty. Oh people of God. Ah yes, wrap up your mind in Psalms 118 verse 17. Oh God, we shall not die. Hallelujah. Glory, glory, glory. Oh not prematurely. Oh God Almighty. Ah glory, glory, glory. We shall not yet die, but live and declare the works of the Lord. Hallelujah. Glory, glory, glory. Ah, God, we are fully, I'm fully aware, oh God, that you have told me, oh, that the veterans, some of our veterans, oh God, almighty mothers, ah, God almighty will be going home. Some of our veterans, women, oh God almighty will be going home. Oh, glory to God along, oh God, we young, oh mothers, ah, some young mothers, ah, some young people will be going home. Oh, God Almighty will be saying goodbye. Ah, departure, departure, departure from this world. Hallelujah. Glory to God. But they're not leaving empty handed that belongs to you. Oh, God Almighty, because they are yours. Ah, these are your people. Oh, glory to God Almighty. Ah, God, they have run the race well. Oh, glory to Jesus Christ, our Lord. Oh, glory, glory. Glory, glory, and those, oh God Almighty, that you will have remain, oh God Almighty, to accomplish our works, to accomplish your assignments on planet Earth, oh God, in the year 2023 and beyond, oh God, with joy, we will carry on, with peace, oh God Almighty, we will leap over our walls and run through our troops, oh glory to God, glory to God, hallelujah. Hallelujah, glory to God. I heard in my spirit, hallelujah, globally, that we will hear, oh God, of more mothers. Uh, we will hear, oh God Almighty, of more mothers that will die in child's birth. Oh God Almighty, giving birth, they will die. Oh God Almighty, giving birth, Torabasa, Maki Soto, Rakedia Si, Mako Shandi Raba Sekiaso, Mikindo Babo Si, Thy kingdom come, thy will must be done. Lema Kusa Torabasa, but until then, oh, we joy your people will carry on. Oh, remember those, hallelujah, that will die in child's birth. May they be ready, oh God Almighty, before it's too late. May they that don't know you, oh God Almighty, that will die in child's birth, oh, come to know you as Lord and Savior. May they open their mouths, God Almighty, and declare you, confess you, acknowledge you, Jesus Christ, oh God Almighty, as the only one 
Christ God, uh, the true and living Savior, the Redeemer of this universe. Uh, hallelujah. Oh God, a transformer of lives. Uh, my God, uh, only you can grant unto them through your only begotten Son, Jesus Christ, salvation. Uh, because he's, Jesus is the only way through and to heaven. Jesus is the only way. Because St. John 14, verse 6, reassures us of it. Uh, oh yes, uh, oh yes, Jesus Christ, he is the way. He is the truth and the life. No one cometh unto the Father but by him, but by me, which is Jesus Christ. Hallelujah to your word, God. Hallelujah. Oh, yes, victory to your words. Hallelujah. As we march on, oh, God, praying. As we march on, oh, God, calling upon you. Oh, God, nonstop. As we call on to you, who is the author and the finisher of our lives. You are the author and the finisher of all existence. You are the author and the finisher of our faith. You are the author and the finisher, God Almighty. Oh God, that still our God is at the end of the line. Oh God, the end of our journey. Glory to God Almighty. You are the author and the finisher. Oh God Almighty, some are at a crossroad. Hallelujah. Some are at a crossroad. Oh Oh God Almighty, not knowing oh, where to go and where to turn. Oh God Almighty, I ask of you that you will speak divinely. Oh God, with your sweet, oh comforting voice, the still small voice of God is still speaking to humanity in this world. It's still speaking to his people in his kingdom. It's still speaking to the fivefold ministry. Glory to God. The still small voice of God is still speaking. Oh, glory to God Almighty, to apostles. Yes, uh, the still small voice of God the Almighty is still speaking. Oh, yes, the prophets. Yes, the still small voice of the Almighty is still speaking to evangelists. Yes, God, the still small voice of God, the still small voice of God is still speaking to pastors. The still small voice of God, hallelujah, is still speaking. Oh, to teachers, oh, speak small voice. Oh, speak in the minds of your people. Oh, speak small voice in the earring of your people. Oh, speak small voice of God. Oh, God Almighty, in the hearts of humanity. Oh, speak small voice. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, glory to God. Glory to God. Hallelujah, it's time to guard your mind. Guard your mind against youthful lust. Guard your mind, oh God, against that which is evil. Guard your mind to guard your mind. It's time to guard your mind against evil and clear. It's time to guard your mind against carnality and come into spirituality. It's time to guard your mind against spiritual wickedness in high places and come with purity, oh God Almighty, and with a clear, non-judgmental conscience. It's time to guard your mind, hallelujah, from the filthiness of this world, hallelujah, and come, hallelujah, and drink the sincere milk, which is the word of God, and eat the sincere meat, which is the, oh, undiluted word of the Lord. It is time, it's time, hallelujah, to speak authority to the mind. It is time, people of God, uh, uh, to give unto your minds, uh, God Almighty, affirmation, inspiration, motivation through the word of God Almighty. It's time to speak the word. It is time to speak life over your life. Oh God Almighty, it's time, oh God, to speak oh, the word of God. Hallelujah. Uh, in the mind. It is time, oh God Almighty, to have a rebirth of the mind. It is time for the mind to be reborn again. Oh God Almighty, rebirth. Oh, it's time for renewal. It is time for refreshing in the mind. It is time for a new touch. It is time, God Almighty. Oh God, guard your mind. It is time to guard your mind from oppression, opposition, depression, suppression. It is time by using, oh God Almighty, and 
meditating upon the word of the Lord. Oh God Almighty, it's time to guard your mind. Oh God, in Psalms 1, it's time to guard your mind. In Psalms 2, it's time to guard your mind. Hallelujah. Oh God, in Romans 12, it's time to guard your mind. In Ephesians 6, oh God Almighty, verses 10 through, oh God, 18, it's time to guard our minds. Oh God Almighty, for healing and deliverance, oh, through the book of James. Oh God Almighty, the book of James, oh God, will have, oh God, pivotal heights and pivotal dimensions. Oh God Almighty, higher heights and deeper depths in the house of the Lord, even in this very season and beyond, even in this very month of May, oh God, 2023 and beyond. Oh God, it's time to guard your mind. Oh, from wickedness, it's time to guard your mind. Oh, from maliciousness, it's time to guard your mind. Oh, God Almighty, from loviciousness, oh, God Almighty, it's time to guard your mind. Oh, God, from the works of flesh, from the works of the flesh, it's time to guard your mind. Oh, glory to God Almighty, and begin to focus on the word of the Lord. Implant the word of the Lord inside of you, oh, so that, uh, oh, God Almighty, when the enemy come against you like a flood, uh, the Spirit of the Lord uh, will lift up a standard uh, for you uh, against the adversaries uh, that is set against you. Uh, Almighty God, guard the minds of your people, oh, God, in Isaiah 59, uh, oh, glory to God Almighty, it's time to guard your mind, oh, God Almighty, in, uh, oh, Joshua 1, uh, oh, glory to God, verses 3, oh God to 5, and verses 6 to 9, oh God Almighty and the ladder, and the ladder oh God Almighty, it's time to guard our minds, oh God of heaven and the earth oh God in the book of Genesis and begin to understand and believe, oh God Almighty that which the creator has done, that which the creator has created within us, oh God Almighty it is to edify the church. It is to edify also the world so that the world will see and know that the God who is, who was, and who is still to come, how though God Almighty, the book, oh God Almighty, is to be deposited, Genesis book, oh glory to God Almighty, we were created in the image of God, ah, in the image of Christ Jesus, God's only begotten Son, all things visible and invisible were created by God Almighty. Jehovah God you are. Oh glory, glory, glory. Your name is above all other names. Oh God Almighty, your glory you will share on, you will share with none. Your glory you will share with none. Your presence, almighty God, oh goes before us. Oh God as you transform our minds. Oh God, we will run ahead. Oh God, and declare the good news. Oh God of the gospel of Jesus Christ. Oh God Almighty, we will share all the gospels, oh God. Oh Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John. We will share, oh God, the unadulterated word of the Lord. Oh God Almighty to unsaved souls. Oh God Almighty, backsliders. Oh God Almighty, because you are the restorer of the breach. You are the mender. Oh God of the broken hearted, you are, oh God, sufficer, oh God of the lonely, oh you are the comforter, oh God for the comfortless, you are God Almighty, oh the triune God, and there is none like you. Thank you, hallelujah, for transforming the minds of humanity, the minds within society, the minds above all in the body of Christ, hallelujah. Hallelujah, bath the minds of your people, oh God, with the beauty of your aroma, oh God, with the righteousness of your word, ah, God Almighty, oh God, with the standard of your goodness and love, with the peace that surpasses all understanding, oh glory to God, 
Glory to God Almighty. Bring peace to our minds. Oh God, as our minds stay on thee. Oh God Almighty, let Isaiah, oh God, 26 verse 3 be a reminder. Oh, you will give us peace whose minds is stayed on thee. Let our minds be on thee. Let our hearts be on thee. Let our thoughts be on thee. Let our, oh God, all spirit be on thee. Because indeed, that which is lovely, that which is virtue, that which is pure, that which is holy, that which is honorable, we will think upon these things. Hallelujah. May we dwell in the word of the Lord in Philippians 4. May we come, hallelujah, recognizing that you have put an increase in spirit upon dry bones to live, oh God, five times greater. Oh God Almighty, yes, oh God. God, dry bones shall live five times greater because God, your five times grace are upon the church. Your five times anointing, oh God, breath, oh God of God, oh God Almighty, that you're blue in the church. Hallelujah. It's upon dry bones and dry bones shall live. Ah, oh, live again, live again. You're restoring lives, you're restoring dreams, you are restoring hope again. You're restoring restoring, oh God Almighty, the lives of your people worldwide. You are restoring leaders and leaderships. You are restoring your kingdom, oh God, and the world. You are restoring physically and spiritually, economically too. You are, oh God Almighty, setting up your kingdom, oh God, with a happy comeback, oh God, that none, oh God Almighty, can ever understand. Oh God, what is your doing? You are that kind of God, uh, oh God, that works in ways that never, oh God, can understand uh, completely by mere, oh finite humanity, oh glory to God, because you are indeed supernaturally, oh God, infinite, uh, hallelujah, and so we thank you that you will transform our minds, our finite minds, uh, oh God, with your infinite wisdom, you will transform our minds, uh, with your infinite anointing, with your infinite touch, with your infinite cleansing, purifying, justifying, oh God Almighty, made whole and righteous before you, touch our minds once more, oh God Almighty, let the mind of Christ dwells within us, dwells within me, dwells within your people, dwells within all nations, God Almighty, the, the minds of all nations. God Almighty, let, oh God, the mind of God be seen above all upon your people. Oh God, as you guard our minds, our God Almighty in Matthew, oh God Almighty, five, we will guard, our God Almighty, we're going to guard our minds. Oh God, when we don't even understand how you're going to provide, we will trust you. We will come to a place in your word, oh God Almighty, to know that you provide for the birds of the air. Our God, the fish of the the seas, the fish of the seas, my God, you provide for them. You provide God Almighty for the lilies. Oh God, you provide, oh God, for all creeping things that creep it upon the face of the earth. You provide God, my God, for everything that you have created. And so thank you that there is indeed a greater spirit times five, a provision that has now come and released to your kingdom. Provision Provisions times five, provisions times five, provisions times five, provisions times five has released upon your kingdom and upon your kingdom stalwart, upon your kingdom saints, upon your kingdom remnants, upon your kingdom, hallelujah, builders, oh hallelujah, we have sure grace, oh God, thank you for a light that I 
shine. The light of the Almighty is shining five times brighter upon his kingdom and within the kingdom builders. Glory to God Almighty. Oh, glory, glory, glory. Oh, glory, let our light also shine before men that they may see ah, the good works of God within us and glorify the Father which art in heaven. Be thou glorified as we show our lights, as we allow our lights to shine in a dark world, that they will see the light and come along. Oh God Almighty, saturate us with your light. Saturate us with your divine light. Saturate us, God Almighty, with divine strength. Saturate us, God Almighty, with divine healing. Saturate us, oh God. May we go ahead, God, and bank, oh God, Matthew 6. Oh, glory to God Almighty. Oh, thank you. I heard in my spirit. Oh, God, Matthew 25. Oh, God, there were tables of the ten virgins. Oh, God, five were wise and five were foolish. Oh, God Almighty, the wisdom times five upon the wise. Ah, virgins has come upon the church. Hallelujah. Wisdom, 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 wisdom. Ah, God times five is upon the church. Oh, God, the spirit of the five, wise virgin. Ah, God Almighty is now upon the church times five and will manifest throughout the earth so that the world will see oh, the manifestation of God the Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. Oh, the manifested glory and power. Oh, God of the Holy Ghost. My God. Yes. Ah, yes, God. Ah, the spirit of the five wise virgins are in the church. Oh, God Almighty. It will catapult beyond a human mere understanding and human mere oh, comprehensions. My God, humanity oh, cannot fathom oh, the things in which you're about to do. It will blow the minds of many. Oh, God, destroy. Oh, God Almighty, the adversary's plans and plans. Hallelujah and plots. Oh, devices and schemes. Mighty God, thank you that you have come in this season to transform babies' minds, transform children's minds, transform youth's minds, God, adults' minds, God, and seniors' minds, God Almighty. Oh, God, make us forced to be reckoned with. Oh, God Almighty, because indeed, having you on our side, having you, oh God, running ahead of us, going ahead of us, God, giving us the victory, Oh, God Almighty, we can bank. Oh, God Almighty, Deuteronomy 20, verse 4. It is you that gives us victory. Oh, God, to triumph over our enemies. Oh, God Almighty, we are victorious in you. Oh, God Almighty, we will continue to run the race. We will march on to victory. Ah, God Almighty, praying. Oh, God, like never before. Oh, fasting like never before. Oh, God. God, oh God Almighty, indulging in the word of the Lord as never before. Oh God Almighty, walking and talking. Ah, oh God Almighty, in the spirit like never before. Oh God, let flesh, oh God, be crucified. Let our flesh, oh God, die daily so that the spirit will live accurately. Oh God, hourly, momently. Oh God Almighty, take charge of our minds because indeed it's time to guard our minds. It's time to guard your mind from the filthiness of this world, the darknesses of this world, that which will corrupt our minds, the minds of our children, the minds of our children's children. And so we ask, I ask of you in no other name but the name of Jesus Christ, that your power will transform our minds, households, minds within households, within communities, God, within society, in all oh, the political arenas, oh God Almighty, North America, South America, Australia, oh God, Asia, Oh, yes, uh, 
Australia, oh God Almighty, Africa, oh God Almighty, the Middle East, oh God, Jerusalem, the Caribbean islands, oh transform the minds of humanity within our world. Our world minds need transformation. Hallelujah. So that nations will understand nations better. Nations will communicate better and more effectively with each other. A uh, greater union will be built, O oh God, in division. And where they are unrest, divide. Father God, you are able. Father God, you are able to transform the minds of humanity. Thank you for answered prayers. Thank you for hearing the cries of your people and acknowledging our God the tears that they have shed. Thank you. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen, 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 and amen. The Lord bless thee. The Lord keep thee. The Lord make his face to shine upon thee and be gracious unto thee. The Lord lift up Ah, his countenance upon thee and bless thee with his peace and world. I say shalom, 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 shalom. Amen. Blessings, everyone. My name is Reverend Dr. Seneth Brown, the founder and host pastor of the New Testament Church of Christ, the Redeemer of Canada, a place where dreams are realized and destinies are fulfilled. I am the last daughter of late Bishop Elijah Brown and late prophetess Estella Brown. It's with great privilege and honor to present and introduce to you my fifth book, which is titled The Holy Spirit Prophetic Poetic Reflection. And they are right here. This is the soft cover copy, and this is the hard cover copy. Bless the Lord. I give God praise for these. It is amazing, life transforming, edifying, uplifting, motivating, and overcoming book. Just to give you an insight into my new book. This book is my first autobiography and is an inspirational, triumphant memoir about my life's eventful reflection with a few poetries. I am coming from a very humble beginning. I faced enormous struggles, dreadful issues, distressing crises, horrible situations and circumstances, painful problems, dangerously adventurous moments, and not to mention being destitute. No season is wasted. Reaping God's double, seven times two equals 14. Restoration this season. The Holy Spirit prophetic poetic reflection is now ready and available for purchase. You can purchase my book on Amazon, Google Play Books, Barnes and Noble, Chapters Indigo, Apple iBookstore, Friesen Press Bookstore, and many, many, many more platforms. I declare to you today that your life is marked and designed to win and to be successful. Never give up. Hold on to the rope of hope. Find your rightful place in this world and leave a legacy before you exit. Thanks a bunch for purchasing my amazing, life-transforming, power-pack, redeeming book. A book that will change your perspective, change your outlook, change your life forever. Thank you. Once again, thanks a million for purchasing my awesome book in soft cover and hard cover. Thank you. The Lord bless you. The Lord keep you. 
the Lord make his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you and bless you with his peace.